Okay, so today I'm going to talk about the Marvel Comic Book Reader app. Okay, uh, this map is a f or this app is free on the iTunes Store. Uh, I'll just go ahead and show you it. I've already downloaded it, but um, all you have to do is go to iTunes, go to your App Store, uh, sign up, register, and then it's a free download. So go ahead and just download that. Once you've done so, it'll pop up right here. Just go ahead and click it and open it up. This is how the startup looks like. And as you see, I already have a comic running, but I'm going to show you how to do everything. So go ahead and close that. And this is what you'll see when you start up your um, Marvel comic book reader app. Okay, This is the main menu. It shows all the featured comics right there. And then the prices as well. You can go into them and check for details. Uh, as you see here, it shows uh, view preview, buy in print, and full series. Gives you the option to check out the preview of this comic book. Okay, you see it just loads up right there. You can close it. I'm not going to show you that, but um, next thing is buy and print. You can actually buy a copy of this uh, comic book if you like it that much. And then also, you can subscribe to a full series, which is um, I guess they'll update you whenever a new, uh, new comic comes out, new edition comes out. And you can also go back and download all the older, older editions. Okay, uh, I'm just gonna close that. Up here, you see featured, new, popular, and free. Those are the different types of comic books you can download. Uh, right now, it's on featured. Uh, you go to new; it shows all the new ones. You can actually browse through these covers as well. And popular comics here, and free comics right there. So okay, so go to free. Uh, as you can see, it shows the all the prices are free right here, and also for these two, you see read right. Um, those are the ones I already downloaded, so I can just go ahead and hop into that and read it. Or if you wanted to download this, for example, Fantastic Four from 1997, number 57. If you wanted to read that, just click on free, and this window will pop up again with the same options. Just go ahead and click free again, and it'll ask you to download this comic. Okay. Um, Oh yeah, that message said that I needed to register with Marvel in order to download this comic. Uh, I've already done so, but um, what you need to do is just go into settings and go to register. Just go ahead and sign up. It's free. It takes only a couple minutes and after that you will be able to download these, these comics. Okay. Uh, once you click on download, it will come over to this page again, my comics page. Uh, let's say if this one, the Spidey, uh, Amazing, Amazing Spider-Man wasn't downloaded and I was downloading right now, it would be gray and it would have a status bar underneath showing the download status. Okay, um, this is my library of comic books. I only have two right now, but you see that I can scroll through the, the two different covers. Um, to go into the comic, just simply touch the comic book cover and click read. Okay takes you in there. Um, you see how the picture is very clear on the HD display. Um, all you need to do is swipe to change pictures like that. And another cool feature for this application is the sequence. Um, basically, uh, I don't know exactly how to explain it or if there's a name for it, but basically you can read each sequence by itself and it'll go in order. It'll go in chronological order. Okay, so for example, I wanted to read in sequence mode. Uh, I'll just double click on this picture. It takes me like this. All I have to do is just swipe left and right to go back and forth between the different boxes. You see how I just went back, but um, go forward, go to the next box, go to the next box, and it'll automatically keep taking me down the next ones. So whatever I need to read next, it'll pop up for me. Okay, to exit this, just double tap again. It takes you back to the page. There's also a thumbnail navigation bar that all you have to do is tap once and it will show up at the bottom. And this lets you pick through the pages without going through page by page. Okay, pretty cool. You can also zoom in, move around as much as you want, zoom out, and that's it. Pretty cool application. It's free. Uh, go pick it up at the App Store. Okay, thank you for watching from Handheld Items. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.